Hi friends, today's lesson is all about a practice video for our math lessons this year. Now, I'm going to tell you a few things to get us started. So, first things first. When we're doing these math videos, we're actually listening to learn. This isn't just, uh, I get to sit back and relax and watch the video. This is more interactive. Sometimes I'm going to tell you information and you're going to answer back to me, or I'm going to give you a problem to solve and check yourself. So we really want to make sure that we're listening and paying attention to the video. All right? For every lesson, you're going to need one of two things. You either need a math journal, somewhere where you can just keep a collection of all the good work as, as we're learning and practicing, or a dry erase board. Well, your dry erase board, of course, you're going to need your marker. You want to make sure that you pause when I say to pause in the video and press play when you're ready. It's not a race to get through the video. We're all doing all of our good learning. Okay? And of course, make sure you have a nice quiet spot away from anyone else so you can focus on your good work. All right, so this is how it's going to work. Today we're going to talk about my favorite food. Now, I love pizza and I love tacos. I mean, who doesn't like pizza and tacos? They're delicious. Do you agree? All right, so right now I want you to guess. If I just had to pick one food, would I pick pizza or taco? Oh, man, I don't know. This is a hard decision because I love them both. I'm going to have you go ahead and take a good guess. Now, either in your math journal or on your dry erase board, I want you to write down one word. Which one do you think is my absolute, absolute favorite? Pizza or taco? Go ahead and press pause while you write down the word, and then press play to check yourself. Okay, friends, you should have written down either pizza or taco on your board. Did you do it? Okay. Now, I know sometimes we think, I'm just going to think the answer in my head. No, 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 no. This is a listening to learn. That means that we're learning and practicing. So make sure you're writing down your good answers to check yourself. Okay, if I had to pick my favorite, I would pick a uh, pizza all day. I love pizza. I like cheese pizza and pepperoni pizza and sausage pizza and veggie pizza. Oh man, I love pizza. <gasps> One time I, ate, I even had potatoes, bacon, and cranberries on a pizza. Oh my goodness, it was delicious. It might sound wild to you though. How'd you do, friend? Did you do a nice job? I mean, if you said taco, don't worry about it. They're delicious, too. Okay, go ahead and press pause and erase your board. Press play when you're ready. Okay, is your board all erased? Excellent job. Let's go to the next question. Now, let me just tell you a little bit about myself. I love the color blue, and if I had to pick one animal that I could own as a pet, I'd pick a sea otter. Oh my goodness, aren't they so cute? I love them. Their little faces and their little hands. So that's a little bit about me. Now I want to know about you. Your assignment today is to tell me your favorite color and what animal would you choose for a pet if you could pick any animal in the entire world. All right, what I would like you to do is I want you to write down those good answers, either in your math journal or um, on a dry erase board. But then I want you to take a picture of it and I want you to send it to me on Seesaw. All right, good luck friends. I can't wait to see how you do. Good job practicing.